Hello, today I'm going to show you how to format your micro SD card uh, before flashing the uh, Ubuntu Linux uh, operating system image dedicated for a Jetson Nano developer kit. Um, so uh, this uh, developer kit um, requires the uh, special dedicated image that you can find and download a zip file from the official guide provided by NVIDIA. Uh, but some steps uh, from this guide didn't work for me and I had to use some alternative application. Uh, I am Windows user, so I had to use this SD card formatter, um, which is a um, good application, but doesn't provide you any option to change the uh, file allocation type that will be used for formatting uh, this, uh, this storage. So, um, the, without this option, I was not able to properly boot my uh, operating system with the NVIDIA Jetson Nano single board computer uh, with the default NTFS or extended FAT uh, that was uh, supposedly used by this application uh, the, the the operating system system was not able to start. Uh, in order to solve this issue, I just downloaded the command line application, which is called uh, FAT32 uh, format. Uh, so you can download this application with the use of link that I provided down below the, the, the movie. Uh, but before I can format the the drive, I will need to, to see this drive, yeah, and as you can see, uh, under letter D, I have no SD card recognized in my operating system, because I uh, flashed already the Linux image onto this card, and because of this, Windows is no longer able to recognize as a letter there. In order to overcome this problem, you need to uh, open up the uh, disk management where you have to create new simple volume for your uh, SD card. I will just left, uh, leave a D letter for this drive. Uh, I don't care about file system. Uh, as, as you can see, you can't pick the FAT32, which is the correct one for the, for the Ubuntu image. Um, all right, now I am able to see this drive. And once it's done, I can start the formatting with letter D. Okay, now it's ready. So once it's ready, you can just uh, use the Balina Etcher application, pick the zip image and start to flash. Yeah, so that's basically it. Thank you for watching. Bye.